chicken. Catch the chicken to the van. <laughs> okay, so this is called the pig place, and this is the van at the pig place. And it's in Banbury. And it's in Banbury. About four miles outside. Yep, and it's on a beautiful, gorgeous day. I hope you can hear us. It's a pretty rustic site. The water's out of a borehole and there is a chemical waste point. So what we're going to do is just going to have a little look around. And show you some pigs. And show you some pigs. There's the most gorgeous pigs. There. And there's free range chickens everywhere. So if you don't like chickens or you're a bit frightened of chickens. I'm just going to turn you around slowly. Hold on one second. It's not a good place to come. Yeah. So. Hi guys. We're Tony and Debbie. We're Tony and Debbie. And we are. The like likers. likers. Like -a -likers. <laughs> Hold on one second. That's my gin. Don't be a knob, Tony. Mm -hmm. So we chose this place because it was pretty rustic and we thought it would be a bit cool. Um, and it is. And it if is. you've got kids, this would be a fantastic place to camp. Yeah. Um, so they do free range eggs and the chickens roam completely free throughout the whole camp. They're everywhere and anywhere, mostly pecking at your toes. Um, yeah. And as you can see, there's all the chickens just roaming free in their little uh, living in idyllic bobs. life. Living in idyllic life, yeah. And as we walk around the pens, we we'll walk around the pens. This is called the pig place because they raise rare breeds. Yeah, they do their own farming of pigs and so they've got a farm chickens shop. Chickens and stuff. Where you can buy pig products. But they've also got an um, outdoor cafe, for want of a better word here, where you can buy pork products and eat pork products. And they've also got Trotter's Bar, where you can go and drink. Which we'll show you in a second. And, but the great beauty of this particular site as well is that it's on the canal. So is it the Oxford Canal? I don't know what canal it is. I think it's the Oxford is, Canal. Is it, is it the near canal? I don't know. It's the far canal. So um, it's right on the canal and one of the quirky things about this site is that they have put loads of sofas and tables and fire pits all in different little groupings right up against the canal and you can sit at night and make your own little fire and sit and get a drink from the trotter's bar and just watch the world go by. And so this is the uh, canal down here. There's a place where you dump your grey waste there. And this is the canal, as you can see. You come round, and what you've got is like a little that that's a like jacuzzi there. Look, is it? There's a hot tub, so you can have a little hot tub. The pigs, the pig place, canal, outdoor cafe, and bar. And obviously, this is where people moor their narrow boats. Which, if you have a look around, this is like where the motorhomes are over there. Obviously, you have some pigs. stinky it is a bit stinky but hey you know for a pigs in a pig wallow <clears throat> it's a gloucester old spot is it a gloucester old spot gloucester old spot reveling in the mud look to keep cool one in the shade in here it's massive there's a football over there look just chilling in the sun so if you spin round sorry if i'm doing this a bit too quickly um but this is the narrow boats moored up which i have electric hook up which is really, really nice with, on along the canal. And here, what you can have, I don't know if you can see this, are a set of lovely, what are they? Sofas. And they've got these little barbecue points where you can take this kindling here. It's got an honesty box. You go honesty the, box. You go the next day and tell them how much Put it in your kindling, sit there, have your barbecue, and have your or little just a fire pit, or a fire pit you don't have to do that and they sell marshmallows in the farm shop along with what else do they sell other farm products jams other jellies, farm products ice jams creams, jellies alcohol. ice creams alcohol and and certain pickles and stuff don't they yeah little cafe come whatever it is and here's trotter's bar so you could sit here in trotter's bar and have a beer just vlogging for a little bit Everybody else seems to do it. Yeah, <laughs> like and subscribe. Like and subscribe, yeah. We've actually got four subscribers. Hey, <laughs> hey, hey, hey. You've got to start somewhere, are yeah, you? Absolutely. There's Trotter's Bar, look. 
Fantastic. Well, they say Doom Bar, which is really lovely. YouTube. Yeah, we're on YouTube, yeah. Uh, like a like as we're called. Like a like as. The like. Like a like as, yeah. I'll, I'll subscribe. <laughs> yeah, sure. What's up, man? Thank you. <laughs> and there's the trough where you can eat and drink and be merry. Off you go. Don't you tell your kids. Oh, I've got a farm shop. I'm going to the farm shop. And round here is the farm shop. It's where you can go in and I won't go in. Smile because you're on CCTV. And look, that guy's just like a little shop there, look. Where you can buy little local produce. Lovely Rolls Royce over there. Love this sign. Just to show you. This is for disabled parking, which is quite interesting. <laughs> and up the top here is where the car park is. So it goes like a around in a complete circle trotters bar there down the bottom there's all the pig pen which is in the middle these are the uh, these are the toilets so it's all chemical toilets fresh water is here which they do from a well and uh, you go toilet there and work your way back down onto this section here Obviously there's a train in the background, I don't know if you can see that, but that's quite noisy, but you can't hear it anymore. Now what did he say these were? Something lop ears or something? Who? Something lop ears. Lop eared pigs. And lop eared are, pigs. There's less of these in the world than there are pandas. That's what you told us yesterday. That's what he said, yep. Yeah. Lop eared pigs. Or something. But it's the smell of the country, that's all you can have. Yes. That's a car park up there where you would park, and then we've got Where's all the, the other. Hole? Pardon? Where's the ball hole? Ball hole's at the top. Have you got it? Show me. Yep. That is Madge. Hold on a bit. Can you do Madge? Who? Madge. Who's Madge? The big, the big pig. The big pig? More chickens? They come up to you when they think you've got food because you haven't. And there's the pig there. She What's in this one then? Who's in this in, one then? In the middle, which you can't see, is a mummy. She's just had Ooh. baby piglets. And there's like a, there's a piglet in there, or pig in there. There is a pig in there. They're all asleep. These I don't blame you because it's quite hot. These are the Vietnamese potbelly pigs. The Vietnamese potbelly pigs. There's a few lambs. Look at this pig. <laughs> don't. Hello. Hello. What? What? Yeah. Get off my land. That's what it's thinking. Yeah, no, he's thinking. Come on. Oh, there's another one there, look. There's two of them just grazing and eating all the grass. Having a great time. It is a lovely, lovely relaxing place to come. And it's a nice, beautiful place to come. Um, I would say if you're thinking of coming on your motorhome, because um, there's a motorhome or parks, levelling is quite an issue because it's quite, it's quite bumpy and there's no uh, waste uh, disposal on the area, on the immediate area. You've got electrical hookup, but your fresh water's at the top, your grey waste is down the bottom, which you have to get rid of. Um, so if you've got a waste master you or something like that, you're going to need something like that yeah. just to empty out the waste tank. But other than that, it's beautiful uh, on a lovely sunny day. As you can see, we've got the uh, stabilizers quite high up. Yeah, stabilizers quite high up with all the chickens underneath. I don't know if you can Roos see that. Roosting underneath. <laughs> all the, the, the chickens shade. roosting underneath. And they do tend to go in your motorhome. So if you leave the doors open, <laughs> They're straight in. They're straight in. So, hopefully that's just a little tour of the, uh, the pig place. And the van. And our friends over there, Tony and Julie. Julie's a little bit of a, she's wine connoisseur. <laughs> okay, well that's signing off guys. Hopefully that was interesting and uh, we'll do another blog or vlog in the future. So if you uh, just don't forget to like subscribe and comment down below and we'll see you soon again thank you very much bye